Well, hello and welcome to part two of this month's What's in the Young Living Box. And this is the unveiling of the October order in Australia. Um, and we, it was the refresh, recharge and recommit promotion this month. So lots of things uh, that were free that had to do with health and um, uh, uh, coincidentally or not so much the products that I bought this month were all about health as well apart from maybe the Savvy Minerals one there so what I'd like to do is I'm going to talk about uh, one of the some of these products here not all of them because some of them are, are fairly familiar um, so I'll talk about uh, energy which is one of the one of the new oils that I got which is a, a young living blend and the energy contains naturally occurring constituents alpha pin, uh, pinene, eucalyptol, camphor, meristocin and geran geranium, geranium and it's, um, it's an energizing, revitalizing, uplifting and rejuvenating blend um, the uh, essential oils that are in the blend uh, rosemary, juniper, lemongrass, nutmeg, balsam canada, clove and black pepper which are all excellent oils for supporting I have from what I have had a look at they're really really good at supporting joint and muscle health um, so have a look at those um, those oils and you'll see what I mean um, now on the website Young Living also say that it inspires feelings of support and, to, and it's for help to release feelings of separation and isolation. So once again, I'm looking forward to doing it. Um, they, they also recommend that it's quite good if you would like something that is an alternative to your coffee in the morning. Um, some people go to um, a Ninja Red for a bit of, um, a bit of healthy energy, um, which I do. Um, but it's recommended that you can rub some of the energy on the bottom of your feet to give your body a bit of a, a boost as well uh, from those essential oils. Now, I'm going to have a sip of my peppermint infused water. Now, Cool Azul, a product that I have already used, I've run out, I've been out for quite a while. I used it for when I would struggle um, with, I do stretching for my, I have a, a hip complaint and so I do quite a bit of stretching uh, with resistance bands it's, 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 and a lot of squats and it's pretty intense but it's what I need to do to stay off the operating table um, and it's working really well for me. One of the things that I do is um, I need something to help soothe those muscles at the end of my exercise and Coolazool I found was was excellent in that. Now Coolazool Sports Gel is one of the, is a special product. What makes it different to other sports gels is that this one um, has an unprecedented 10% of pure essential oils in every tube. So that 100 ml tube, 10 ml of that is essential oil which you will not find in, a, in any other product. Um, the lead ingredient in it is aloe vera, which helps that absorption uh, into the skin, into the body. And um, it's hydrating for the skin, and it boasts topically cooling blend of essential oils. And so the blend uh, is your peppermint essential oil, menthol, camphor, and includes Plectranthus oregano and it also includes uh, Dorada Azul essential oil which is a, a Young Living exclusive. So all naturally derived ingredients so we're talking optimal health from your sports gel there. Uh, now the mineral essence something I have about every probably four or five days when I'm feeling a bit flat. The recommendation is to have it twice a day. I find I, with the other things I'm doing, I don't need it that regularly. But when I do feel a bit flat, this is something I will go to. And the reason why is it because it contains um, over 40 of um, natural liquid mineral minerals. And they are 
um, the most efficiently absorbed form of minerals that are available that you can that you can take. What are those minerals? I'm going to attempt to read the ones that are in mineral essence. The ionic trace minerals in mineral essence are barium, ber beryllium, bismuth, boron, bromine, calcium, carbon, cesium, chloride, chromium, copper, gallium, germanium, gold, hafnium, indium, iodine, iron, lithium, manganese, molybdenum, nickel, niobium, nitrogen, oxygen, phosphorus, potassium, rubidium, scandium, selenium, silicon, silver, sodium, strontium, sulfur, tantalum, thallium, tin, titanium, tungsten, vanadium, yttrium, zinc, and zirconium. That's over 40. It also contains essential oils, cinnamon, peppermint, and lemon, and it's in a base of royal jelly and honey. Excellent, excellent product to take. If you're feeling, I basically have it when I'm feeling a bit flat. If you're a body is basically telling me, hey, you, you need a little bit extra, and that's when I'll have it. I'll have five eye droppers, that's about five mils, in a big glass of water like this. Down it, tastes horrible, but hey, it, it really gives you a boost really pretty quickly. Um, now, the sulfur zion capsules I take every day. I have osteoarthritis, that's what this product is for. Uh, a lot of people also have it for... Um, uh, healthy hair and nails um, because of the the sulfur the MSM in it if you have a look at what MSM is good for there's, there's a heap of things and we'll cover a little bit of that here um, but basically sulfur zion capsules according to the Young Living website is to provide temporary relief from the pain of osteoarthritis and it contains three active ingredients which are MSM Ningxia wolf berry fruit powder and copay eba essential oil. MSM is a naturally occurring form of dietary sulfur and it helps to relieve joint pain associated with osteoarthritis. Now I'm going to read um, also a little bit uh, from the from WebMD um, and I'll post the link at the bottom of this clip and this is to do with one of the so there's three active ingredients but one of the other ingredients in them in there is silicon dioxide um, which has a lot of very very healthy benefits now it's not silicone like you would find in a in a breast implant this is silicon silicon dioxide um, and according to webmd and i quote some people take silicon by mouth for weak bones osteoarthritis heart disease and stroke cardiovascular disease alzheimer's disease hair loss and improving hair and nail quality it is also used for skin healing and for treating sprains and strains as well as digestive system disorders. That's specifically I'm talking about silicon dioxide. Now let's have a chat about Megacal. What do I use Megacal for? I use it in a nightly cocktail. Um, I put in uh, one scoop which is about 5 grams of Megacal. I add some uh, a teaspoon of turmeric half teaspoon of, um, of uh, uh, mega greens um, and I also add to that uh, one shot or 30 mils of apple cider vinegar with honey and occasionally I'll put a shot of uh, Ningxia wolf Ningxia um, red with that as well but usually not then I mix that up top the glass up it's this glass here actually top it up with water and down it and surprisingly it does not taste too bad um, what I have found in my case is I found it helps me with my sleep um, so I struggle a bit with my sleep since I've been doing this I've slept well but I also feel fantastic like I seem to during the day between my sulfazyme, my omega-3, my ninja red at the start of the day, and this at night, I feel fantastic. 
So what I wanted to do was just have a little bit of chat about MegaCal. So MegaCal is a powerful calcium and mineral powder. Um, and the supplement is an excellent source of calcium, magnesium, manganese, and vitamin C. Every 5 grams, every serving, contains 207 milligrams of calcium and 188 milligrams of magnesium. Now, what I'll do here is I'm going to quote from a couple of um, articles. And these are about the specific ingredients. This is not uh, from the Young Living website, so I'm going to quote and leave the links at the bottom of this post. According to healthline.com, as far as magnesium, it says not only can magnesium help you get to sleep, but it plays a part in helping you achieve deep and restful sleep as well. Uh, to add to that, the National Library of Medicine says supplementation of magnesium appears to improve subjective measures of uh, insomnia and sleep efficiency, sleep time, and it goes on a little bit more there about that. So I'll let you have a look at that. I will leave the link, National Library of Medicine. Um, calcium, and this was something I really didn't know. I knew mag magnesium was good for sleep, but calcium, this was interesting. This is from uh, Medical News Today. It says calcium is directly related to our cycles of sleep. In one study published in European Neurology Journal, researchers found that calcium levels in the, in the body are higher during some of the deepest levels of sleep, such as rapid eye movement. The study concluded that disturbances in sleep, especially in the absence of REM deep sleep or disturbed REM sleep, are related to calcium deficiency. Restoration to the normal course of sleep was achieved following the normalization of the blood calcium level. So it's no wonder it helps me with my sleep. One of the other ingredients in MegaCal is manganese, and it's an essential nutrient involved in many chemical processes in the body, including processing of cholesterol, carbohydrates, and protein. And that is from uh, webmd.com, and it's uh, under their vitamin section. I'll leave the link. And also uh, another one that's from PubMed, from the National Library of Medicine, uh, regarding vitamin C, specifically about sleep. Yeah, it says that it, vitamin C prevents sleep deprivation induced. Uh, oh, sorry. There's an article that's called Sleep. Prevent sleep deprivation induced elevation in cortisol and lipid peroxidation in the rat plasma. So uh, I'll let you have a look at that. That was an actually a journal article from the Department of Physiology, Faculty of Basic Medical Sciences. Um, and I will leave the link for you to have a look at that. So I think that's why <coughs> I find these really work really, really well for my sleep. So what I'll do is we will we'll continue, we'll make this slightly longer. I've just got two other things I want to have a quick talk about. The first one is the Royal Winter Eyeshadow Palettes, that's this, these ones here. And this one um, is, so there's three new palettes, three different ones. This is the Royal Winter Eyeshadow Palette, and it contains four different colors. So you've got um, Grace, which is the pale pink shimmer. There's Unwind, which is the, the light mauve matte finish. Jewel, which is the marine blue shimmer, and Enchanted, which is the slate shimmer. So these are all formulated without talc, no parabens, um, and they're made with the best natural ingredients, which include 100% pure lavender essential oil and minerals. Now, the minerals are used in the case of Savvy Minerals um, for the colouring. <clears throat> now, according to uh, Fitness Magazine, regarding synthetic colourants, it says, this is an article by Ivy Boyd that was, do you really need to avoid these makeup ingredients? And under synthetic colorants, it says, colorants derived from coal tar have been linked to cancer. 
but the FDA have since banned the ingredients in question. This is in America. Some experts do see a risk in current colorants, but the FDA continues to monitor the ingredients on the market. If you want to keep it natural, you can opt for mineral-based colorants like mica, mica pigment, titanium dioxide, oxides, iron and tin oxide, carmine and ultramarines, which is what is in Savvy Minerals eye pellets. So they contain iron oxides, mica or merca, mica I think you say, titanium dioxide, iron oxides, ultramarines and iron oxides. So a much safer, healthier alternative. Why take on the risk when you can have something that that is healthy and natural? Now the last item I'm going to talk about before we finish is Omega Gyre, Omega Gyres. And for me, this product is the absolute bomb. I've been having it for about the last month and I have noticed a real uh, health benefit since I've been taking it. I was having, the funny thing is it, can, so it contains fish oil, it contains eubiocarinone, which or coenzyme Q10, uh, Q10, and vitamin D3. Now I was having those separately. I was buying them from the chemist. These are all in the one. You have two, two capsules in the morning and two in the evening. It also contains clove essential oil, German chamomile essential oil, and spearmint essential oil. Now to read from the Young Living website, why would you have these products? Because they're an antioxidant and re reduce free radicals formed in the body and these are all, this is for adults, not for children. Uh, free radicals, so it reduces free radicals formed in the body. Maintains support and energy level in adults. Helps enhance and promote general health and well-being in adults. It maintains and supports healthy teeth in adults. Maintains and support bone health in adults. Maintains and support healthy cardiovascular system function in adults. It maintains and supports cognitive function and mental function in adults. And maintains and support brain function in adults. So, with any chance, I'll get a little bit smarter. We'll see what happens. Anyway, that is this month's What's in the Young Living Box. Heaps of free stuff here. If you missed part one, is when I did my unboxing and I talked about what I got for free. But basically, this whole order contains $175 worth of free product, which includes the water bottle, two of the essential oils, the cool all, and the middle essence. Now, if you don't know how to get free stuff, <coughs> you need to check the link at the bottom of this video, and it will uh, link you to the rewards section of my website, and you can have a look, look there. It explains everything. To get started, uh, if you're not already started with Young Living, there's a link to how you can get onto uh, one of the wonderful startup packages, which includes, which is this one up here, the, the one in the palette up here, which is 10 essential oils, plus you get an extra essential oil blend, and you also get a diffuser, and that enables you to get started with um, Young Living with the 24% discount as a distributor. No, you don't have to sell anything. No, you don't have to distribute them, but you will get the discount. If you sign up to Essential Rewards, then you get cheaper freight. I've already talked about this in part one, but you also get access to Essential Reward bundles and a heap of other goodies. You get you get these freebies will also come with your orders, depending on how much you order. And this month's order, as I said, was the refresh, recharge, and recommit. And next month, November, we're already looking forward. I have no idea what's coming, but I know there's going to be a few good items on there. There always is. So anyway, that is it for this month's What's in the Young Living Box. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope you've learned something. Please leave your comment at the bottom. And I look forward to speaking to you again next month in What's in the Young Living Box. Until then, stay healthy, everybody. Good night.